Fleming, what did you make of that performance? A, a few changes made, but it, it wasn't too bad in the end. If you want to win every game of football, you know, there's no doubt about that. We set our stall out to come here to win. We've made a lot of changes for a variety of reasons, mainly the, the consecutive run of games that we've had and players have played a lot of 90, 90 minutes, you know, with, with the greatest respect to this trophy and, and to, to guys, it's not a priority for us at the moment. You know, we're getting a bit, bit of a run in the league. Uh, we're doing quite well in the FA Cup and it was a good opportunity for us to have a little look at a few other players and to get some 90 minutes into, into a few. Um, we've used it as that, but don't get me wrong, we're disappointed in there because we wanted to win this game of football and in all honesty I thought it was a game that perhaps we could have won. Look, they dominated the game, there's no doubt about that, they dominated, they had more chances, more crosses, more possession, but it was only 1-0 up until the, until the 90-something minute. You know, We were well in the game with, with a squad of players who have not played a lot together and with four lads who were age 18 and under. You know, credit to them, they hung in, they competed well against, against players who have been playing at this level and higher for a long period of time. So, you know, I feel, I feel disappointed to lose the game, don't get me wrong, but at the same time, I feel quite proud of a few of them and how they've performed and how they've acquitted themselves against, against a good side. Yeah, we held our own in, at times, didn't we? Especially, like you say, with the, with the amount of young players we had on the field. Yeah, I mean, look, you, you, you're looking around, it, positives are we've had some of our more experienced players playing, I say experienced, the ones who are over 18, one of our, some of our experienced players playing, organising, trying to facilitate um, the younger boys' performances. You've got young lads who are just working really hard, trying to play a decent shape, um, trying to get into the opposition's faces, and when they get the ball, trying to use it right. And, you know, the, the honesty, the endeavour from, from our players is, um, has been really good and they've given guys a really strong game and this is a guys this side who have just beaten Southport a guys this side who have beaten some decent teams this year and yeah we've given them a, you know, a run for the money with, with, a, with a few players who have not played a lot so look really credit to them as I say they're disappointed but the, you know, we're taking the positives we've got a few of our young lads some minutes and, and some real experience in, uh, in a good cup competition so what's the plan now? We've got, I think, 11 days off now between, uh, between now and Boxing Day. What are your plans now? I think recovery is important for our players and we're going to utilise um, certainly the next few days. We might come in on Thursday, we just need to confirm. But possibly we'll come in on Thursday, do a little bit of work with them and perhaps give them the weekend off. And I'm sure they'll be, they'll be fighting for a weekend off, but we'll see about that. And then, you know, for us, it'll be in train on Saturday, potentially. And then we'll go and watch one or two of the, the teams that we're up against. But it's come... Look, as I say, we wanted to win, but to have Saturday off with the, the games that are coming thick and fast, you know, there's, there's, there's certainly some positives to take from that, and I think we're going to utilise that to try and freshen, freshen up our bodies and our minds a little bit.